Hey, Yum and Doomerang, are you well? I hope you are. I wanted to, Yara, talk to you today about one gay meat ants, or just ants at any particular species of ant, but today is probably one gay meat ants. Why does Mark want to talk to you about ants? I'm supposed to be talking about radry culture. Well, they are very important to our culture, and they're our, like our weathermen, weather ladies. They tell us when temperature's going to change, when the urung, whoa, when the urung comes down like it is there now. They also tell us when it's going to change temperature, brrr, whoa, and they also tell us when it's time to move. Very important. Jump in my bus for a minute, and I'm just going to take you down the road. We're going to have a look at something. So, jump in. You ready? Here we go, down the road. We're not going to go too far. It's not that long a drive. Actually, my journey's called Mullerill, so it's not that long a Mullerill. Okay, stop. Whoa! Radio, everybody off. You're all off. Cool. Go away, you bus. She's gone. I wanted to explain to you about, if you look at this little screen up here, this is a little video I took the other day of one gay meat ants. And look at them rushing and rushing and going and rushing and going. As long as you see them taking tucker and stuff in to their nurung, their nest, that's cool. If they're bringing it out and they're on the move, it's time for us to move. Something's going to happen and it normally means lots of urung. Oh, gee, ooh, watch out for that lightning there. Lots of urine coming. But also what one guy tell us, and today's about meat ants, is they also tell us about climate change and temperature change. So when it starts to warm up, around their nurung, their nest, they'll start to change the walang, the rocks, and also the baliwagan, dead animals. They'll start to change the colour of those. They might change the rocks, the walang, from black to white, or a lighter colour, and same with the dead animals and the branches, they'll change colours. And then as it starts to, say, warm up, they'll start to change all the black ones, and they'll start to bring in the light coloured ones, or the white ones, and they'll put all them around the nurung. Hmm. And then as it starts to cool down, they'll then do another house change, another air conditioning change, and they'll change all those two from the light colours in the really hot weather, start going to the dark colours in the cold weather. Now, that's a way of black or dark attracts heat, so they want the heat to come to their gunya, their house, and in summer they want that to stay away, so the white or the light colours reflect all that heat back up to the year, back up to the sun. Hey, there he is. He cool, isn't he? So, that's a little bit about one gay, meat ants, or ants in general. So it's very important that the little things in our country are very significant, and the little things will teach us about the big things in Nuremberg, in country. Hey, hope you learned something today. Uh-oh, here comes that bus again. Oh, jeez. Anyway, happy days. Magawa Yiradu, happy day. I've got to go. See you next time. Make sure you push that subscribe button down there so you can learn more about my videos when they get released. Hey, go you. See ya.